What is Pompeii disease? It is also known as glycogen storage disease type 2. It is an autosomal recessive condition that is estimated to affect 1 in every 40,000 births. It is caused by mutations in the GAA gene that makes an enzyme called acid alpha-glucosidase. This enzyme is required to break down the complex carbohydrate glycogen and convert it into the simple sugar glucose. Glycogen is a thick, sticky substance and failure to properly break it down results in massive accumulation of lysosomal glycogen in cells, particularly in cardiac, smooth, and skeletal muscles. Symptoms of the infantile form of the disease begin in the first month of life, with feeding problems, poor weight gain, muscle weakness, floppiness, and head lag. Respiratory difficulties are often complicated by long infections. The heart is grossly enlarged and many infants also have large tongues. In the late onset form of the disease, there is minimal cardiac involvement, but there is skeletal muscle weakness progressing to respiratory weakness and death from respiratory failure after a course lasting several years. Without enzyme replacement therapy, the hearts of babies with infantile onset Pompeii disease progressively thicken and enlarge. These babies die before the age of one year from either cardiorespiratory failure or respiratory infection. For individuals with late onset Pompeii disease, the prognosis is dependent upon the age of onset. In general, the later the age of onset, the slower the progression of the disease. Ultimately, the prognosis is dependent upon the extent of respiratory muscle involvement. Help us increase awareness and raise funds that would go a long way in meeting the needs of these afflicted individuals, informing policies, and in promoting research for better understanding of the disease. Donations are accepted at the Philippine Society for Orphan Disorders.